The National Railroad Museum here in Ashwaubenon is finally ready to begin an expansion that's been eight years in the making. The museum is showing us what the expansion will look like and the funding it still needs. The $15 million expansion will open the museum up to the outdoors, allowing people to see the Fox River from the exhibit area. We are knocking out our back wall and extending it towards the river and we've already done a lot of work on our riverfront and we're kind of joining the outdoors and the indoors. Museum CEO Jacqueline Frank and her team announced this week they've raised most of the 15 million dollars the project needs. Our funding definitely, it's coming from three different places. We're looking at corporations, we're looking at individuals and then also from the state of Wisconsin too. Frank says the project still needs another $2 million from private donations. She says that will allow the museum to double its educational space and expand the hours that it offers private events. The way we're structured right now, we're fighting for space all the time. You know, there might be an overnight education program we want to have. Well, there's also a wedding or there's a, some other community event that we all want the same space. The plans also call for four more train tracks and cars inside the new exhibit space. The museum may lengthen its hours on summer evenings after the expansion. And the museum says ticket prices should remain family friendly because more private events should fund the operating costs. Some events like the Festival of Trees will become invitation only. We're really looking at using the new space to enhance existing events. Frank says the project is on a tight timeline. If all goes well, the plan is to break ground in April and be complete for the NFL draft the following April. The groundbreaking of the Fox River expansion could be any time between April and August, but the museum is hoping for April.